Today we will build a steerable robot controlled by a wired remote. Each button on the remote controls one motor. Press one button to turn the robot. Press both button to drive straight. Before we dive into the project, an important announcement. Join our exciting initiative for school student. Build this or any robotics project and share photos or videos with your project name your name class school and location via whatsapp number on screen we will feature your work on our channel celebrating your creativity and inspiring others don't miss out share your amazing projects now let's get started here what we will need two dc geared motors with compatible wheels two mini breadboards one double battery holder two lithium ion batteries two push buttons solid core wire for breadboards and other connections wire strippers and lastly we need two wheel acrylic car chassis with its accessories first of all let's understand the breadboard rows of five holes are connected internally the gap in the middle separate connections these adjacent rows are not connected now understand the circuits connect the positive wire of the battery holder in any row and negative that is black wire in a separate row now connect motor wires. One wire to the row with the positive battery wire, another wire to the row with the negative battery wire. And see the motor spins. Let's add a push button. It has four pin, we can say legs for stability. Place one button pin in the row with the negative battery wire. Connect the motor's wire to the opposite pin of the button. Pressing the button closes the circuit, causing the motor to spin. Now assemble the car chassis. Mount the caster wheel using the screws and bolts which come with the chassis kit. Mount the motor properly on the chassis and pass the wire from the holes provided. Connect the wheel by matching the slot on the wheel and motor shaft. Now chassis assembly is complete. Let's set up the circuit for the robot. Refer to the wiring diagram in the description or pause the video to view on screen circuit diagram. Now, take the first breadboard for the robot circuit. Connect battery pack, red and black wires to different rows. Connect negative wires of motor to the same row as the battery pack's black wire. Leave red motor wires disconnected for now. Take the second breadboard for remote control. Insert two push buttons in separate rows. Now connect the remote to the robot. Use long wires to link the two breadboards. Take a small piece of wire and connect the inner pins of buttons. Connect one wire between breadboards one positive row where the red wire of the battery is connected and breadboard second inner button pins. Connect the remaining wire of motors to the corresponding button's outer pin using long wires. Alright, your steerable robot is ready. Press one button to turn or both to go straight. Enjoy your creation. Want more fun projects like this? Subscribe and start building today.